WFMY News News Jess Winters went to those elementary schools in Alamance Burlington with cases. Kids are learning from home, but parents still have their concerns. School is remote for the first nine weeks, but parents I spoke with are still concerned because their kids physically went inside buildings for orientation recently. You know, I was a little bit nervous because my son was there last week for his kindergarten orientation. Samantha Zayas says Alamance Burlington Schools notified parents of a positive COVID-19 case Wednesday, though rumors were already running rampant. There was a um, post going around on Facebook being transparent with parents and, you know, letting us know so we can be informed and so we can cover everything that we need to as well. It just would have been nice right away. School board member Patsy Simpson says two people at Altamaha Ossipee Elementary School in Elon and at least one person at Highland Elementary in Burlington tested positive. It kind of caught me off guard, to be honest with you. Though the district hasn't confirmed the specifics, citing HIPAA laws. Well, they said that, you know, anybody who had come in contact with the person who had the confirmed case would be notified. Staff members are still going to school while kids learn from home for nine weeks. A district spokesperson says staff was not required to return to school until all contact tracing was done. The Alamance County Health Department says no additional coronavirus cases were found after the tracing. I just hope that the kids can go back to school soon and that this all, you know, goes away because it's really hard to be a mom, a teacher, to go to work every day. The health department did not recommend the closure of the schools and the district says no learning has been disrupted. Jess Winters, WFMY News 2.